Good afternoon, Diamondbacks. I'm Sophia, and today's Wednesday, October 7th. Welcome to the Daily Diamondback. Hello, everybody. My name is Tyler Moss, and Diamondbacks, the homecoming game has been set for Thursday, October 22nd. Nomination for the Royal Court begins today and will run through tomorrow, Wednesday, October 8th, and will close at 4 p.m. The form is located in your counselor's Google Classroom. You must include your ID number without the zero at the beginning. You will nominate one girl from your grade level. Seniors will nominate a girl and boy representative. You must put their full first name and last name. No nicknames. Voting will take place next Thursday, October 15th. Seniors, don't forget to fill out your FAFSA application. If you submit it this month, you will be entered to win a scholarship. Go to the counselor's Google Classroom to find out more information. And don't forget to join this Friday's FAFSA session from 11 to 12 and 3 to 4. The Pioneer Hosa students has partnered with NHS and Robotics for a Self-Care for Healthcare gift basket supply drive for our frontline workers at Mission Regional Hospital. Anyone can donate items listed on the screen by dropping them off at the school's front foyer by November 5th. Students, it's time to decide if you will be returning to campus for on-site instruction. Here is a video from our Pioneer Administration with more information. Hello Diamondbacks! Soon we will be opening our doors. Are you ready to come back? Before you make that decision, parents remember, it's your choice. Log into Family Access before October 9th to mark your yes or no. Remember students, to wear your mask all day, every day. It's important that we work together to eliminate the spread of COVID-19. Please do your part by doing your daily health screening at home before coming to school. Every morning before first walk, all students and staff will walk in through a temperature scanner. Your forehead or wrist will be read to determine your temperature. If a student or a staff member has a fever of 100 degrees Fahrenheit or higher, they will be assessed by the campus nurse. And always remember to wear your mask all day, every day. Lunch is going on here. As you can see, all the tables and booths have been replaced with student desks, which have all been strategically arranged. Also, we will be entering the cafeteria through the east side doors and exiting through our north and south side doors. Due to the circumstances, lunch deliveries will not be allowed this year and all microwaves have been removed. See you soon, Diamondbacks. And remember to wear your mask all day, every day. You are about to watch a video on our restroom procedures. When you're in class and you need to go to the restroom, you will need to sign out with your teacher. There will be a QR code that you will need to scan. Once you are out in the hallway, you go directly to your restroom. There is no lingering in the hallway. We will have a restroom monitor that will ensure that there will be only two students allowed in the restroom at a time. You might have to wait in line. You will need to maintain your 60 distance at that time. And remember, wear your mask all day, every day. Today we'll be watching a video on passing period procedures. Passing period will continue to be seven minutes long, but we will release students by wing, east and west. Students will be instructed to follow the appropriate hallway directions, must follow arrows. Once students arrive to the classroom, they must line up against the wall where decals will be located. Restrooms will be locked during passing periods. And remember to always wear your mask all day, every day. You are about to watch a video on our custodial cleaning procedures. This is what we are doing to keep you safe. Custodians will be responsible for hourly restroom checkup and cleanup. Night custodians will be responsible for deep disinfection in the evening and will ensure that all chairs, desks, light switches, door handles, whiteboards, and teacher stations are clean. QR codes will be located throughout the campus. Whenever you see a QR code, you must scan before entering that area. Remember, wear your mask all day, every day.
Hey Diamondbacks, be sure to wear your Sherryland ISD approved mask all day and every day. Go Diamondbacks! Don't forget that the last day to submit the Parent Choice Plan survey is this Friday, October 9th. Have your parents log into Skyward to submit the survey. That's everything we have for today, guys. Remember to be kind and smile. We're halfway through the week. Thank you for tuning in. This has been the Daily Diamondback.